The following feature is rated SM for spiritual maturity and is not intended for the immature who wishes to remain as such. The views expressed are not necessarily those of our sponsors as they sometimes could care less about what the host is saying but is more concerned about having their product on a popular show. Warning, small minds, listen at your own risk as this content is extremely overwhelming and may do further damage to those minds closed off to objective reality. Approach with an open mind as the heavy nature of the content will lick your chip. Your chip. In the meantime, 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 in between time. All right, purple scout, purple soldier, purple nation, we have watchers. Like our sharers and subscribers, welcome to In The Meantime bonus episode 11. That one entitled, One I Move. Yeah, man, I still have an issue where most people get past and I look out for the latest mix-up already. So I never going to touch it, but I get too much requests for my opinion upon it, as usual. Today is 17th, I may not even know where this saga going to reach by the time this drop. So stay tuned, stay tuned, stay tuned. In the meantime. Alright, Purple Nation, help me welcome any IT support to the Purple Nation family. Any IT support is a technology company we focus on providing custom solutions for the woman business. Alright, let me tell you that in English. Any IT support is a cyber condom for all our device them. Then protect the devices from all enemies with a real or imagined. So this is a good news for you cheaters especially. We have whole heap of things in them device to hide. So to all of my brother them out there, we have to sleep with one eye open. Because the girl has got to take on her finger and, and open the phone. Them days are done, man. Any IT solutions met them, they have to go in now, man. Call them now at 309-340-1364 or visit them website at anyitsupport.com. Don't just sit on the way the device unprotected. Use a condom every time. Meaning to so use any IT support. The ultimate cyber condom, condom, condom. In the meantime. In the meantime and between time, what is coming is coming. This section of In the Meantime is brought to you by Renaissance Immigration Services. Your yeah, man and deal with all things immigration in Canada, they are the greatest thing. Just call Renaissance at 437 to eight, and the consultation is absolutely free. And please remember, say if you're in America, you hear about Renaissance Immigration, I say, well, I want a service like that, don't panic. You know what I mean? There is Lewis Law Professional Association. And like me always say, when the whole graveyard of immigration crosses are run your dung. Yes. Lewis Law can put a stop to it. Them deal with things like visa, citizenship, removal of conditions, waivers, and all matters related to immigration in America. Call them now, 954-530-171717. In the meantime. I'm going to tell them, say you're a star on the world, a curly locks are on the world. You know that. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Come on, Charlie. 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 Come you know, everybody know the events of the past few days. And all the protests with the taxi man them turn out. Well, for those who don't know, apparently the taxi man them decide to strike. Because they said they want amnesty from the government in relation to some outstanding ticket. And some of them tickets are run up in excess of two hundred and three hundred thousand dollars right, However, let me deal with one year in the clip, in the audio clip first. With the brother way a bad up himself. Apparently him and all other people. This side say no tax enough to run. If some now nah run. And he bring badness into play and, and it appears so one of the passengers them secretly video him. And he go viral and he turn star and the police them decide say boy you're them first one book him. For your live performance and alright they say all I madness start. Now after the country condemn the big board bandit and care him go lock him up. Say them all teach him a lesson. This man at the back of the road in a less than three. And them have a whole heap of people lock up. For how long, you know, simply because somebody pine pan them and say them do something, make an accusation, you know. When a proof 
if you be true all now. And the people them they are jail all long without bail. Whole heap of time. And this brother get caught on camera. I commit a grievous offense we wanna charge him for. And him they are road over enough people wanna hear said do it. You don't know what kind of country this is. Or even worse than that now. Some of the biggest media house them. Turn the man in an instant celebrity. With major headline attention. All this big woman who is supposed to have sense, man. Big old Zip FM now. Go gift wrap the board in a kin teeth. And basically, I tell a man who traumatize a car load of woman. Say next time him for threaten and beat responsibly. And everybody outraged and of course. Them forget it. Them deserve the outrage against them. And rightfully so. But a zip of the problem, yes, sir. I fuck with them, do you know? Yeah, man. But for me, the biggest takeaway from this, from, from what happened with zip. Is that zip just really and truly where zip do it, is show we who we are as a people, at least the majority are we. Them show so them consider the average person no higher than a feeble minded picnic. We're easily impressed by the least of things. Zip FM, like every other business entity, work off a demand and supply. So, where you want to say, most of we not demand fuckery and foolishness and stupidity on a weekly basis. Where them business entity uh, exploit. Well, we are trying to say, we're not impressed easily by foolishness. How can it be an insult for them things that we that like this? When some time we even like worse than this every week, every other week. So, them insult we. If you think we wouldn't kin with it, have a one more fucker. We know see people come say them can't cross it. And a helicopter them end up on a got some face. Man company news gonna talk something in a funny way. And we turn them in a certified stock and we love kin with fucking teeth. We don't say all disabled people do some little fuckery and a, and a biggest thing. So why it would be an insult if Zip FM consider so this is a one more foolishness what we actually like. Actually, it's a mirror this them all up to we, you know. And we see our own reflection and turn idiot, you know. We don't have idiot every week. I, I measure up with, with, with certified celebrity. I show Zip, I show we, you know. I mean, no, they don't do it deliberately. But this will happen with them, show away. I know every fucking thing with a kin teeth, but what if a people are ball? I say great, like Bob Marley. I say great, and that for fucking up. Another part again, the media does I show you how them work over the years. The media show you every day how them understand with nature. So we could have cost till God come and the hell shop on the beach and drink jelly. Say so people for stop top about the money, top top about the clone, you know. I know the media know exactly how we stay. Them know so they can sell with any fuck we bite. And we are the biggest consumer of fuckery for decades. I hit lead to this. Them keep the foolishness what we like in a rotation, right round the clock. But a fool for all that. Oh, I won. We could have ball so we want change till we weak. We don't want it. Can't change anything at all. Take a fuck piece of work. Whether if you change your mind or your body, same thing. It take establishing a pattern in a course of action. And stick to it. Most of we just can't pick a side. And never choose a way. Most of we just never choose a way. Yet. If we don't like the foolishness, them can't give you the foolishness. So stop love the foolishness. And the foolishness stop. Problem solved. You know what most people are saying? And that's true. Most of them taxi man. Yeah. A bus man. Are the worst driver on the road. That is true. I wish I could have simply say. Taxi man and them indiscipline. Are the only cause for everything we're wrong in our situation. Yeah. Me really wish me could have said everybody in the situation just now one discipline and that's it. And that's the problem. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen, problem solved. But it's not that simple. This like every situation, I mean whole heap of things where we just overlook. Deliberately or unconsciously. Most of us are go with popular opinion. We don't care what you know. We just say back with everybody else. I say. We just always run with the more popular opinion. And in our case, the more popular opinion is that taxi man and bus man are the worst. But again, it's not that simple. Everybody measure reality according to feed them own experience. And they're not going to put themselves in nobody else's shoes. In other words, the whole of people who live in our life where they make three meals a day and they're all right. The person that is more likely to see a hungry man as a troublemaker. Just like how the taxi man in discipline broke all kind of rules, drive and lick down people. And do all kind of fuckery for up with a portion of ticket where them can't pay. 
or no one pay. And the excuse is always that you have to make the boss money plus fee money. Because society people don't know where they go through and one bag of talking. Nobody now find common ground. And as usual, I blame the other person for the problem. And while I fully 100% agree, so the reputation I tax him kind of fuck up, it boils down to one thing. When I say every week, or every episode then, or almost every episode, and that is, if anybody at all, in any kind of problem, I got to do the right thing, them are willing to lose money in order to get the outcome there. And also, while I agree, so the ignorance and the emotion, not forget the best way when we try to achieve certain things when it comes to protest or industrial action. I mean, I agree, say a man for a beat an ex taxi man and a mash up them vehicle and I force them to join the protest at a right in this of the problem there. Because I think a whole lot of people misunderstand why the taxi man them now end up a force the other man them who no one join the protest. For join the protest. And most of we condemn them for those actions and think it that simple. Because we just have pre the beginning and the end. There's a whole lot we are going on in Miguel. And when you come up in our surroundings or circumstance where nobody never show you say, or, or, or you never come up in our surrounding where talking or communicating your feelings or something you need for do. Everybody stay quiet because bad man not talk. Them, them outcome you normally have. Because anything you practice, you get better at it. And most people in them circumstances, they are our circumstances, never really practice communication. So as usual, even though them have a great point or them have certain feelings where they want to express, the feelings them kind of mix up and they all both them not organized and them always come out wrong. The anger got to take the value out of the way I try to say. Just because a man no know how to say what he wants to say no means he doesn't have it to say. No. And here it is that people are mash up other people care. How unfortunate. Yes, very sad, very, very unfortunate. But I think I kind of understand the point where the taxi man them try to make. I just say them go about it totally wrong. But no matter how you don't are even ignorant, Frustration I always naturally result when you ask for something in every way and can't get it. Me understand the frustration. One set of people can stand up and the rest of them sit down. How the protests are effective. A protest is meant for whatever you are protest about. Be felt, not seen, felt. A protest is meant for show how significant you are to a particular equation. And when it comes to protest, however sad it is, the innocent always are going to end up. Feel it in terms of whatever you disrupt with the protest. Yeah. So me hear people I say, boy, it affects Jamaican people and this and that. That's what it's supposed to do. However much we don't like it, protest is always meant to get the attention of those who are discredit your contribution to the equation where you protest both. So if one set of man stand up and the rest of them sit down, have the man fall, still at work, still I get to do everything, nobody now go feel it. Because that would have simply mean you just not get taxi on time today. Pun intended. You feel it when there is no taxi or, or, at all. I miss a couple of people I say, boy, the government them not feel it, you know, because they not take taxi. A regular people feel it. I agree with that. But that would have been in relation to the immediate effects. But what about the long-term economic effects? The government have to deal with that. And while I don't agree with what they must say, 100 percent because them indiscipline no bumbo cloud fit you. There is a whole lot where we now factor in where affect them taxi money on a daily basis. We need to fix for real. But see there, nobody can lose no money if you do the right thing. And when I say that, I just say industrial action and protest at Jamaica can never be a real true and solid thing because you always have people within a group who just take the abuse instead of resort to any kind of action we can improve them life and them, them, the only thing that that improvement they're going to come by way of them being willing to lose a DSP or a couple of DSP to improve their own situation I think of the type of frustration there with that type of attitude lead the taxi man them to go on with a bag of fuckery against their own colleagues and again while I can't mean, do it it's understandable Look on the situation with the hotel worker named Matthew. Remember that about four or five months ago? No quote me. Remember that youth that don't have So Piras just deal with him wicked and fire him and get him off of the property and one bag of thing. And I want you to appeal to the rest of them to stand up. This is not right. When him look around, I'm alone out there protest. And even to know I'm alone, still I got through it. And the man say I try to get another job even now and the same big name them. A, black, a, a blacklist him. And I deal with him wicked. You'll never work in this town again. Like Hollywood. Every, every, every time there's a problem, you know, it's like, you don't notice it. 
Every day people agree, say this is the way for going. You know, this one, me just name out, you know, the way for go, man, the whole way for come together and re, 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 and help one another and this and that. But when there's a situation where everybody weak and have them unfold, it, when you just go on the, the, the side of the people and we have them, we just weak and have them unfold, then how oh, it a got change? How oh, it a got change? How oh, it a got change? How oh, change a got come? If all we do is sit down and spectate and just ready for have an opinion for something and just attack a bag of things we don't understand and are willing to lose nothing at all. No willing to be part of the change. Splitting justice is a boring thing, no? It's boring, bad, a lie. You want to feel excited. You want to cuss, man. Be impressive, no? Not all of them, because I know real purple people, no? Stay a certain way. But it's more exciting and become cuss, no? I can't split justice. I'm going to find these things within the equation and just truthfully point them out. It makes the show kind of a lie. Do you know, I stir it up there, though. No? And that soon drop, by the way. Me answer you if you even go ask the question. Soon drop, man. It's going well and little. But when you look for all of the truth within a certain situation, it just, you just feel odds, right? But then you're not really addicted to the problem, right? You're good. You really want to change. Life and everything went wrong with it. It's a show where I watch you, yeah, man. You watch TV. Now, nah, have nothing to do with you. People, if you fix the problem, I impress you. While you sit down and play a game of no matter which part the pendulum swing, you got all this over there because the two reality can't happen one time. Yeah, man, if everybody sit down and have them and fall, and say, boy, right now, I'm going to look my food, you know, and re, 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 what would have been most of the comments? What would have been more of the, most of the opinion then? Boy, you know, Jamaica people can't unite. And again, I mean, I said nobody if you resort to violence, we make nobody at all join them. But up, not looking at the situation. But this are the unity. We're not talking about, you know. I'm going to think the man them go about it wrong, you know. People are stand up for the organization where you're in and you have to support it. Most of we always have one fall and say, make them do it, make them solve the problem, make the rest of taxi man them, go out, go make the sacrifice, we are going to benefit we. But we not willing to put no kind of sacrifice towards it. No for no coming like that girl when I want to unite with a man and contribute our actual efforts in, in, in achieving the, whatever goals they want for the relationship. And stand up with them and fall. I wait for him to do everything. And of course, about how hard it is to achieve them goal. Eh? Where them no one lift a finger for help achieve. Yeah, man, no for no coming like that girl the way I say, look how long he must struggle for do that they sitting there all no one can achieve it. And I know say, if she's willing to make the sacrifice and just join him to achieve quicker. No goal can achieve quick enough if everybody were in a particular group or relationship now have the same level of commitment to the goal. We could have chat till we're dead. But guess who I got to talk the loudest? Like a them do it. If the taxi man them achieve that sit down there or they come into the table a full for attention them try to get the government or whoever involved. You know who talk the loudest? The people them will never want to involve. The people them will never want to sacrifice. The people them will never want to do none of the work. Have the biggest talk. I mean them ranks you have people who don't want to resort to the violence. There. Everybody always, everybody is a part of a group. Twin reality is right wicked. But you see, the most negative one are the ones who paint the reputation of a group. You know, everything, the most negative one are the reputation that the group always get. Me sure say you have a bag of taxi man, I want to do the right thing, I want to do it the right way. But we can't see past the negative one them and get to them one day. Because we love the drama, we're addicted to it. We're addicted to having a fight and our opinion about everything. And yes, with us up. I'm ready for point out. Nobody will do the right thing, no give you that thrill there. They no give you that excitement there. And I write another excitement there on the downfall there. Write another thrill there. What the fuck do you want to think on the eat? Do you know? I mean, now stop telling you. Ask on yourself, no man. Put on yourself in a taxi man's shoes and ask a question. Yeah. Put on top of the ticket that you actually deserve. You get the one that you come off of politics. Because police own car and bus. And I do things to sabotage it at the regular people in my own car and bus. And I issue out excessive and unfair ticketing. Just for sabotage regular people who have car and bus. What do you think I got? That I go left the whole time and them for doing maths. You know? And by the time them don't pay fair and unfair ticket, them in the red. Because they must, them still have a factor in the bar zone. If enough for them own vehicle. And plus, I me never me even a factor in. How much, much money they have to pay in a bribe daily. It's a maths problem. Every problem is a maths problem. Plus, bad man and government attacks them in every way. And the dirty insurance company, we're not business. We want to your vehicle. 
they don't where you really are pay for a dip on the road. So them our next set of extortionists. We just like the bad man not provide no service. It was a pay for live. And in this case, they are pay for dip on the road. So enough man asks the question, where them are going to get if them pay them ticket here? So you find say all the man no who that well want pay it. I feel end up I do the same thing. Like the man them when I pay it, just simply because they're indisciplined. So the situation is as simple as how people love to just jump and something and just go on like an ABC. It is not ABC. Nothing on ABC. That injustice exists. And police just call him friend and just say, yo, license plate number, this, this, that, 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 come your way. And by the time a taxi man look at 10 different tickets. And that the police them one bus do to eliminate the competition. Remember me telling already, you know. The police stopped me a care about a long time. You know. I'm going to feed them care. <laughs> and carry out a bag full of weed. I said, look what I find in your car. And I said, what you say to me? No, you just take that out of your car. I don't know nothing about that. I not even smoke. And the man said, what am I here? You which one the judge or believe? Just give me your money and go on about your business. Them time they are long before career. Them time they are long before I get no big name. So it did even worse. So if them a deal with me, so who is that a competition or a threat to them? Imagine how them a deal with the taxi man them. And the way most people address the taxi man them like the man and nobody a fuck with that bridging. Everybody and them granny have a video. I class the man them the most way. No funny just want to talk to people who are here, you know. No, 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 no business watch you, you know. And just dying for get a clap, you know. I mean, you're a man say a thing and a chew. If you don't have nothing to say, shut the fuck up. Because enough of them so-called man they never want to strike have, have, have the most ticket to. Same way. Them are no angel neither. No for no regular motorists will love to talk about reckless driving or taxi man in discipline a road. No buy no buy no license. You know no driver either. No for no think indicator paper light you know. You no know, respect it. You know much time I put on my indicator and I see man one mile from me drive fast. I kill themselves for pass me. No for no think driving I just press gas and hold steering. You no know, know what is a right away unless I something you don't know. Right away. I mean, I also say the whole entire world, I say, oh, this, that, that, I don't know if strike and people can't move and one bag of thing and one white effect. Yes, that is true. Go to a nurse, doctor, teacher, and whoever else strike is not a problem. A true man. People dead at the hospital when nurse and doctor strike too. And gunman and every other branch of criminal get a bonus when police strike. Every strike affects somebody in a some area. Not for one way I talk about discipline and accountability, just to learn some word. And why you and yourself talk like I don't mean them. Cause I don't put them in on the life, on the life. In the meantime. Gangsta is purple. I tell you for the that. When we say purple, we mean that. Alright, my books, Planet Hurt and the Road to Zion, is available on Amazon.com. So get it, get Planet Hurt in all farms by Amazon now. Yeah, man, I'm going to say all farms, we're going to talk about audiobook. They're on Audible, iTunes, and you know, just about anyway, audiobook sell. And the audio version of The Road to Zion, so ready. You know, I mean, they had them knowing that ready. So, you know, get, you know, Planet Hurt locally at JA Deals, Constant Spring Road, you know, right across from the transport center. And check out them website, jadeals.com, for where they have them other locations, where they also have the book and everything. So, I'm going to know that JA Deals also ship internationally. To the Caribbean, etc. I can also get Planet Hurt upstairs Island Grill Twin Gates Plaza in a place named Cellular Repairs. And it also their selected location, a Kingston bookshop. And also if you have selected time, J A deals, you know them have a limited 10% discount on the book. So you know, find out more about that in the description. I'm going to also pin a comment with various ways of you get your hand on Planet Earth. Do it now, do it now. This next section of In the Meantime is brought to you by Renaissance Immigration Services. As you know, already them deal with all things immigration in Canada. Your days of painting card green is over. Them fix the visa where you overstay because you're frightened and run off and now people are taking advantage of you in every way, shape or form. And you work for less than where you work. And you feel so there's no way out. Renaissance believes that as long as there was a way into your immigration problem, there is always a way out. Just call them now at 437-703-1147-8. And as usual, the consultation is absolutely free. In the meantime. In the meantime and between time, what is coming is coming. Yeah, you know. 
a true time reality and a dream time. Curly locks. In the meantime, 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 meantime. A full time the leadership realize that them to stop tech such simple approach to complicated matters. And this no need no big brain and PhD. Just common sense. This no call for a state of emergency. You have to come off of the American playbook where you, where you try to, make, to, to, to appeal to everybody's feelings and make everybody happy one time. That's impossible. The courage to offend and the only thing you can build about this. You can't ask no kind of picnic with a literal or adult picnic. If you understand maturity when them not dead so yet. You have to force them to grow up whether they like it or not. We can't wait for everybody to agree before we can move forward. That not ever happen. If Jamaica will come back, a whole heap of people have to go back. I don't know, I don't know how, how, how I don't notice that this is a police problem. Police will be on the road and monitor things to make sure that the protests run under order. Every station should have been on high alert. Kind of like someone never knows that this is going to And soldiers should have ready to deploy at a moment's notice to help enforce order. People are running people with big boards and they draw them out of the car. And a tic tac police have seen that pan. And I've seen a police not get draw up. I don't know what I'm to the country right now. What the government has faced is a dilemma. Having to choose the lesser of two evils. The indisciplined gunman and the indisciplined taximan. And the first question we are leader have to answer before them know how to proceed with what is the solution to a problem is which one of the two in this case is more beneficiary to the economy. I mean, I know about the next man. May that choose the indisciplined taximan over the indisciplined gunman any day. You don't prefer a man to run from police. More than a man to run down police and kill them. You have a set of man who not only get respect from most people for not make no kind of contribution in a positive way to the country's growth or upliftment. A amnesty for bringing gun by a certain time. I mean, I don't know who I advise you, but nobody, them, they, they, nobody love gun like gun man. 98% of the 99% or 99.5% of them now nah, carrying them gun. What's the ultimatum of them really I get? Look into it. What, stiffer penalties, longer prison sentence for gun? In our, a country where they can't go to jail, go use phone and keep party. I even fuck girl a weekend time, same like them there road. A man I got afraid for go, which part not, not change in terms of them reality. For 15 years, 20 years. Stiffer penalty is supposed to make a youth afraid for be a gunman. In the same country where how much youth see how much other gunman before them dead. And still take up gun and do the same thing. The entire paradigm won't change. This one social intervention from the root. If you're not going to do something drastic like find the whole fucker them and murder them. Then everything are just acting. Good intentions. Wishing up on a star. Because the gunman and every other decent law-abiding youth from the ghetto. A twin. You can't tell the difference. And politicians over the years know the difference. But them use the gunman for retain power. So get rid of the gunman that means that them have to go play politics fair and them none of that. Because them have to willing to lose them power. If them have to do the right thing. We're not willing to invest time and resources in knowing the twin them different. So we can murder the right one them. We're not even willing to do that. Because outside of that, how you going to solve it? How you going to solve that crime problem? Without apply the same brute force where them are applied to his society. And you going to reject amnesty for a set of people who feed them biggest crime. If you run from police, park the wrong place, cut off people in the traffic, overload a car, don't have proper insurance. But which one of them worse? If you have to choose the lesser of the two evil, which one worse? And you really think you have less gunmen in our country where everybody respect them? Yet the taxi man choose to do something more honorable. Get disrespect every day as dirty taxi boy. The worst taxi man better than the best gunman. Morally. So my advice, Mr. Prime Minister, choose the lesser of the two evil. Choose the one beneficial to the growth of the country, the country, the country. Oh, yeah. In the meantime, 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 in between time.